Hi, my name is Emma Miller. Um, I'm a senior studying atmospheric science and planetary sciences here at the EAPS department. This past summer, I was able to go to NCAR at Boulder, um, the National Center for Atmospheric Research, and I was able to participate in the undergraduate leadership workshop. Uh, basically, students from around the country got to come and learn more about how to lead in the science field. So we got to take leadership training, basically how to lead groups of people that maybe have different styles of interaction as you. Um, I got to have diversity, equity, inclusion training, as well as just how to be a leader and how to understand people that you're working with better, which was super awesome. So the EAPS faculty reached out to me initially and asked that I'd be interested in this opportunity and thought that I was a good fit for it. And I said I was, obviously this was a great opportunity. So I had to go through an application process. So I had to write a few essays, basically my personal statements on diversity in STEM and why I thought I would be a good candidate for leadership training. And once I sent that in, I waited for a few months and then I heard back from them that I had gotten into it, so. The ULW is led um, by two co-leaders, Tim Barnes and Jerry Sikoni. Um, they are really great people. They ran a great program for me. So those are two people I worked with mainly. Um, they set up all of the training for us. They set up all the um, interactions that we had with other professionals there, and they did a really good job. ULW-wise, for me, I really enjoyed the diversity, equity, and inclusion training. It's not something that you get in classes usually, and it was interesting for me to see other people's perspectives on how their representation is shown in STEM environments and how to create STEM environments that are beneficial for everyone, all however they identify, which was really cool for me. Um, and then outside of that, I met really great students while I was there, other people that were in meteorology or climate science. And in the evenings after we got back from the Mesa lab, we all went out and did like an excursion at the end of the day, which was super fun that we all kind of put together. So we did hiking because a lot of us enjoy being outside. We did a few hiking excursions, um, like on the Chautauqua Trail. We also um, just went around through Boulder, went to the um, Pearl Street, got to eat dinner together and that kind of stuff. Just bonding with other people in meteorology that weren't from Purdue, which was really awesome for me. Get to meet other people. I'm looking forward to hopefully seeing a few of them when I go back to AMS in January. I would absolutely recommend this program to anyone who has the opportunity it really expanded my knowledge on how to work with other people because as our advisor always says is that science is like a team sport you have to be collaborative with people so getting out there and learning how to lead but also working groups was super helpful for me so i would definitely recommend it to anyone i love being an ambassador for the department that's like the main thing i do besides working with my club and that's been super helpful for me to get to meet with incoming high school students um and get to practice my present like speaking to the public about what we do here and that was really really awesome um i enjoy my classes a lot um you have to get through those hard classes like calculus and whatnot but when you get to the apes department and you're with those classes that are like you're you're like friends you know like 15 to 20 students that you see all the time it's been a really good experience for me to be here at purdue but within the department so i get kind of like individualized attention and I really know the professors that are going to be recommending me as I move on later on in my career. After graduation, I will be attending grad school where I am not entirely sure yet. Right now, I'm still in the application process. Um, I'm looking here at Purdue, obviously, um, University of Oklahoma, Penn State, Texas Tech, maybe a few others. Um, I'll be looking to work with radars. That's what most of my research here has been a, a big part of. So that's what I'm going to be continuing on to do, hopefully.